guys, in this video I want to show you how to apply false lashes. But before that, if you are new, welcome. My name is Ines, and if you are interested in learning how to develop yourself through makeup and fashion, then please subscribe to the channel and click the bell icon to get notified when I post a new video every Wednesday and Saturday. If you are interested in learning how to accomplish this beautiful makeup look, then Watch my video from two weeks ago, the full face with NYX cosmetics. I'll leave it a link down below so you can watch it after this one. I've had a lot of people ask me how to apply false lashes, so I thought the best way was to create a video so I could share my tips with you. The eyelashes I'm gonna put are the Primark Exaggerate, which is these ones. I'm gonna show you like exaggerated like the name says lashes so you can really see what I'm doing but if you have never used false lashes before then it is better if you go for a more natural style so if you do make a mistake it's not as noticeable as these for example are so if I don't do this correctly you will see I also use the duo glue this is the black version I prefer to the white version but it's the same basically and I have the one which is a little brush but it is easier to find the one which is a little tube and you can put a little bit of the glue on the back of your hand and then put the lash through the glue and put it on your eye but when I saw this one in boots if I'm not mistaken when I went to London I thought it was a much better solution because it is black it will make it look like I have a little black liner and because it is a brush for me it is easier to just apply it to the lash band. I do apply my lashes with my fingers because I just find it easier than with tweezers but I have this little pair of tweezers as you can see it's very pointy at the end of it just to make sure the inner corner is well glued to my eyelid and not just wandering around. I got my lash on my hand and the first thing you should do is measure it. Make sure the lash is the same size as your eye. If it is too big, it won't look as good. So let's do that. I'm gonna get my mirror. Okay, so they're just on top of my lashes. As you can see, they are my eye size. I've already cut them beforehand. I've already used this one. But if they were a little big, you should always cut it by the end of it. So the place where it is normally you have longer lashes if you cut the shorter part out of your lashes it will make it more noticeable noticeable that you're using false lashes than if you would cut the longer parts and keep the shorter part these ones don't actually have any part that is shorter or longer they are all the same i have a hair in it what i'm gonna get my glue and i'm gonna put the first layer of glue on the lash band and I'm gonna wait until it gets tacky. And after it gets tacky, I'm gonna add a second coat and then I'm gonna put it on my eye. Also gonna wait this layer to get tacky. It might take a little bit longer because now with the second layer, it just silence. Now I'm gonna get the mirror real close to my face. I'm gonna try and get an angle where you can still see what I'm doing. And at the same time, I can see what I'm doing. But basically, I'm, I'm grabbing my lash by the middle of it and I'm going to try and put it on the middle of my eye. I'm going to put myself in this position where the glue is down and the lashes up so my lashes don't interfere with the false lashes. Almost going to close my eye. I'm just going to wait 5 seconds then leave it, make sure the end of it is glued on. And now, with my little tweezer, I'm gonna glue the inner part of my lash on my inner corner, if I can grab it. Oh my god, no. So as you can see, these are really over-the-top lashes. I don't use this every day, I only use it when I do like uh, going out makeup. Okay, so it's not fully dry yet, but I just wanna show you. The only downside of using, I'm gonna get you a little bit closer. The only downside of using black glue is that if you can see it right there, I didn't apply it on the right place at first, so it left glue there. And if I'm gonna be honest, I can never take it out unless I take out my eyeshadow. That's the only 
that's the only problem I have with this glue. So normally I really take my time, breathe deeply and exhale calmly. So this doesn't happen, but because I am me, of course it happened while I'm filming. But I'm gonna do the other eye and hopefully it doesn't happen again. I really like these lashes. Primark does have pretty lashes and they have like really natural ones or very over the top ones. So if you wanna start using false lashes and you don't wanna waste a lot of money with expensive lashes, go into Primark. Just don't use the Primark glue, really get a good glue. For example, the duo one, the one I'm using. And maybe try the white, white one. It looks white, but then it gets transparent. So if you do mistakes like I did, the glue will get transparent, so you won't see it. Okay, so this is it, guys. Like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to the channel for more tips and tricks. Leave me a comment down below telling me if you ever tried lashes or if you want to try. If you have any question or suggestion for a future video, you can also leave it down below. Follow me on social media. And I'll see you on my next one. Bye!